Hey my friends, what's going on? Gator here on a beautiful, beautiful day, my friend. And I'm so excited here, just having some great time, just having some fun time. And you know, I'm just here with a bunch of our students and I was teaching some great stuff. And we was talking about, you know, the four S's of entrepreneurship. You know, it was one of the crazy concepts that a lot of people got a lot of value from. So I decided, hey, why not make this video and inspire you guys that's watching and understand, I don't know what stage that you're in, but there's four stages in entrepreneurship and you're gonna go through them if you're trying to build a business, you're trying to get yourself to the next level, you're trying to defy all those people who say you want to reach your dream, you want to make your goal happen. And you know, the first stage is gonna be survival. And survival is where you're getting started in this journey and you figure out it's lonely. Like nobody believes in you. Your parents say you won't make it. You know, people say, hey, this lifestyle, this dream lifestyle you're talking about or creating your own income, not having a job or defy the ads, you know, not finishing high school or college, whatever the case is, or whatever race you are or whatever the color is of your skin. But you say that, you know, I am way much more passionate than that. I have something much more powerful inside of me and I'm not going to let the stereotype and I'm not going to let anybody doubt me and say, I can't do it. I'm going to push for my dreams. But you figure out it's going to get lonely and it's going to get hard. It's hard. It's a hard reality because you have no skill set, but you're trying to build yourself, but then you have all the doubt, all the doubter, all the naysayers, all the people who don't believe in you to put on top of it that you got to deal with. So that's the survival stage. Now, this is where the bills increase. This is where you quit your job and now you're trying to make this business work and your friends are laughing at you. Your parents say, yeah, I, I taught you. I, I taught you better. You know, I told you so. You know, people don't believe in you. So you're in the survival mode. You're trying to make a sale every single day. That's your main motivation is to make money. And that stage that most entrepreneur goes into is that stage of survival. You try to make money to feed your kids. Like me, I have kids and I totally understand if that's what you're going through at that moment, you know, the light is due, the cell phone is due, and now your business has to pay for the stuff and you're just trying to make a sale. And you're asking yourself, why is it working for everybody else, but it's not working for me? And I can relate, I can understand. But at that moment, in that moment, you must pour in your mind. You must pour faith. You must work on your mindset. You must pour that it is possible. But you must get around people that are making it happen. Like I'm over here and there's a bunch of students, a bunch of our students who's just really crushing it, making it happen for themselves. So when you get around those people, you see what's real, you see what you can do. It expands your mind, right? It expands your mind and help you go for what you want, okay? So, in the survival stage now, you know, you're gonna start making some money and you're gonna start growing where you're gonna get to the second X that I spoke about, which is the security stage, okay? When you get to the security stage, this is where you start getting the business. You start understanding and don't quit until you get to all four stages or else you're not gonna be successful. So when you get to that security stage is where you making the income now. You feel that, hey, I got it. You have built a business model that's not only providing for yourself, but it's providing for your family. You feel confident. You feel that I got this, I can do this. But that stage is very crucial. I want you to be careful when people get to that stage of security, you don't wanna stay in any comfort zone at that moment. Because if you stay in your comfort zone, you're not gonna grow because your comfort zone is your income zone. So if you wanna grow to the next level, what you want to do is to keep pushing through that stage of security where you feel like, okay, I'm making enough money now. I can, I can pay the bills. I'm making enough, enough money now. You know, I can take care of my family. I'm making 10, 20 k a month now. I got it figured out. You know, what happened with some people at that stage, they get lazy. They think that the money is going to be forever. Remember, you know, passive income is not perpetual income. You know, I teach people how to get passive income on the internet, but it doesn't stay forever. You got to know the strategies change. You know, the strategy change, the tactics, they do change over time. So the stuff that was working yesterday, it probably won't be working tomorrow. Or it probably won't be working today, but that doesn't mean that you quit. It means that you keep pursuing your journey and you keep pursuing your dream until you get around these things that are working, okay? So once you do that, there's no doubt in my mind that you're gonna move to the next stage, which is stage three, the stage of success. The stage of success is where you could go on vacation whenever you want, right? You know that money is not the only factor now. You know you can create income out of thin air. Now, 
income is not the only reason why you do this stuff for. I know a lot of you that's watching right now, you're probably watching from home or already, wherever you're watching from the end and you probably part of my channel and you keep saying to yourself, well, these guys keep talking about how you can make a living for yourself online, use the internet, you know, how you can become successful, but it's not happening for me. It's because you're still going through the stages. you probably still in this first stage of surviving. you trying to just make a sale just so you can pay the bill, but it requires a lot more than that to become successful, right? It has to be so much deeper than that. I'm here with a couple of students of mine. I'll be making some video and put it on the channel for a couple of our, of our students who's making $200,000 in, in about uh, $200,000 a week. I mean, that sounds like some ridiculous number, and I know I throw it out there. Some people might even dislike this video for those types of number because they think it's impossible. And the crazy thing is, two young kids who are making this stuff happen, and that means that it's possible. Those guys, they had no previous knowledge. Now, am I guaranteeing that, oh, that's gonna be your case, that's gonna be your life, that's gonna be your dream? No, that's gonna be the same pattern for you. No, I'm not guaranteeing, but I'm saying that what is possible. So you can create something for yourself based on the vision that's around that. So reach that stage of success where going on vacation is not a problem. You know, do whatever you want is not a problem. You know, it, you can pay your bills on time. You can create whatever you want now. And then now you move into the last stage, which is the stage of significance. This, the four S, the last S, which is significance, where you're not doing things for the money anymore. You don't wake up in the morning. Like people like Bill Gates, they don't wake up and trying to think, yo, you know, how much money I'm gonna make for today, or how am I gonna pay my bills, or I'm a success. They, they doing things because of the legacy. They doing things on a whole different stage. And that's where you wanna leave. That's where you wanna get to in life, you know? You wanna have your goals figured out. You know, another key point that I share in this mastermind is sometimes that as parents, you know, we ended up, you know, regretting our lives and we wanna leave our lives to our kids. So we never went for our dreams or we never went for our goals and then we figure out, hey, why not make our kids do the things that we wanted to do in life, you know? And, and it hurts them because now you start pushing something on someone else's life thinking that that should have been their path. So my thing is that, you know, live your life. Find out what you want to do. Live your dreams and, and just find out what you want to do and go for it instead of forcing whatever you want on somebody else. It's always going to make a bigger impact. It's always going to have a much more powerful impact. Okay, so those are the four S's of success that I shared, guys. You know, I think this stuff can be helpful to you. If you do appreciate this video, feel free to like, um, share, leave a comment below. So what I'm going to do, I'm probably just going to walk around, show you around, and show you a couple of students around here that's having fun. And, you know, you guys can enjoy the view. Enjoy, you know, we have a couple people here talking, just having fun. This is Jermaine here giving some value. And, and you know, and that's, that's what you want, guys. <laughs> just always think, always think that success comes at a price, you know? People around. We have my man over here. Just crushing it. All my guys is just crushing it. So, guys, people are just making it happen. You know, as I'm walking over here, man, people are just making it happen. And you can make that stuff happen for yourself. Got a few students out there just crushing it. This guy over there is massive conversion and e-commerce. Facebook, they crushing it. Um, you know, guys, just, just want you to believe in your dreams. If you're watching this video, just know that it is possible for yourself, you know, but nobody's gonna give it to you. It is not there to be given, but it's there to be taken. So if you want it, as bad as you say you do, you're gonna go get it. Nobody's gonna stop you from getting it. So if you watch this video, right, you stay to the end, I want you to make a commitment. Make a commitment to yourself and say, it's my time. Okay, I want you to comment below this video. Say, it's, it's my time. It's my time to get it and I'm committed to the process, okay? So if you make it to the end of this video, you watch this, I want you to write down, it's my time, right? It is my time to get it and I'm committed to the process. Write that down below. It's my time. It's a commitment to yourself. It is my time to get it and I'm committed to the process. Anyway, guys, if you do appreciate this video, like, share, a lot of massive value. I have some massive interview that's coming for you this week, so pay attention to the channel. Massive stuff is coming your way. Appreciate you. That was Cater. I'll see you guys on the next one. See you guys later. Bye.